Hey, how y'all doing? This is Miss Carr with Fabutainment. I am here with uh, Mr. Lloyd. How you doing? I'm good. How are you? Good. I'm good. Good. It was an amazing show. So. And, and an amazing crowd. Good. Good. Shout well, out to everybody. That came out. Welcome back. Welcome back. Thank you for that. Uh, first question, because I know you got a lot of stuff to do. Um, huge success of the song True. I know everybody wants to know what is an inspiration behind the song True or special meaning behind it? Um, yeah, sure. Inspiration was uh, for a man to be able to be honest and uh, open, vulnerable, um, admitting without feeling uh, like he's lacking something. I know for me personally, I can't speak for other men, but for me, um, my pride can get in the way sometimes. Right. Um, and I think that that kind of hinders me from moving forward, progressing as a, as, a, as a man, first and foremost, and also as a musician. So I, I wanted to maybe uh, address that in a song, and I also wanted to really pay tribute, homage, and, and give a little respect to the everyday working person who has supported me throughout my career, to the people who spend their hard-earned dollars on music, which is something that we don't really need. It's a luxury. Uh, so I think in order to convince people um, that it was worth it, I wanted it to, to have some sort of a meaning beyond anything pretentious. On the surface, you know, um, we, we try to look as beautiful as we can, but the, the real, but the real beauty of a person you never see, you can only feel it. So, mm -hmm. you know, my goal as someone who um, supplies feeling to you individuals <laughs> in the form of music, I wanted to put as much feeling into four minutes as I possibly could. Right. Um, I can honestly say that I am more than proud with the response that is gained. Uh, I'm even prouder of the way my niece smiles at me when she hears it and she sees herself in the video. That's everything. And um, most importantly, uh, I, um, I feel like I've never been able to have the opportunity to really, really put my complete heart and soul into a project. Wow. Um, you know, I think uh, sometimes as musicians, we get into the rat race of things. Right. We want to keep up with what's going on. Sometimes you get those people who you've you've loved and respected for years uh, who come back and they try to do what's new and what's younger, and it just doesn't feel all the way right. So I said, you know, if I was to come back, make music, I wanted it to uh, have some sort of, um, you know, part of me that was there before and for the fans. Good. That, that have always been with me since day one. I didn't want to right. change up, but I also wanted to um, just try and sneak in some of the personal progression sure. that I, I was experiencing at home in private. Sure. So, yeah. Deep answer. Deep answer. I like that. That was a good question. It was okay. Yeah, well, good, good. good. So, out of those five songs, which of those is your favorite? And um, tell us which of the most feeling is into those five? I would have this, I can't really choose. I think that's like <laughs> choosing your children. Your children. You know, yeah. uh, I don't have a favorite. It's uh, all representative of a part of me that was important at the time. And um, I, I think that um, that's the only way that you make it find its, its most potential is when, um, you know, you really care about each and everything that, sure. that you're involved in. I really cared. I put everything I had into them. Yeah. Uh, I co-wrote I co everything. Awesome. Uh, a lot of the music started with me and my guitar at home, wow. which was the first time I took that approach. I co-produced all the music, uh, which was the first time I attempted that. So behind the scenes Wonderful. and in, in front, just really being involved. So I can't really pick because all the experiences uh, are memorable. Well, they're great. They're yeah. great. Last Thank question, because I know you got to go. Um, any new projects, movies, or TV shows in the works? Or well, new well, stuff coming Well, don't out? you folks have ADD <laughs> these days? Right? I, mean, I just put an EP out uh, Other than like that, two like weeks TV ago. shows or anything. And that, I mean, that took me four years to, <laughs> to come up with. Um, well, we love seeing you. We love seeing you. Well, you know, God willing, I don't think it'll take me that long to release any new music, uh, and I've been working on new music. Um, True was kind of like a scale back of uh, a, a larger project that I was working on. Gotcha. So I think I have new music out this year. Uh, I was a part of the Atlanta series with my friend Donald Glover, Wonderful. which was a little step into the other side. Okay. Uh, that was fun. I don't know if I'll do more, but that was cool. Uh, and then, um, I don't know, I just try to just stay in the moment, 
ride the wave and um, and just be there for the opportunities that are presented for me. So wonderful. Well, we love seeing you, and I want to thank you for stopping by Fabutainment, and uh, best success to you. Thank you. And, All right. Uh, big shout out to your listeners and uh, and viewers. All right, thank Thanks you so much. Thank, thank you. you, thank you, sweetie. I appreciate thank you. you.